Remember that feeling when we realise that our parents don't know everything? It feels as though this is what's finally happening with our governments. I mean, we never trusted them with everything, but at least we thought they might have a proper go at sorting climate change, right? But they haven't, and now the consensus is that time is almost up. We have just 18 months before emissions must be going down worldwide to avoid potentially fatal warming. Fatal for us. I haven't had much time this week, so I'm reading this week's climate video straight from the script. Here goes. In the words of Hans Joachim Schellnhuber, one of the world's top climate scientists, the climate maths is brutally clear. While the world can't be healed within the next few years, it may be fatally wounded by negligence before 2020. In the words of Prince Charles, I am firmly of the view that the next 18 months will decide our ability to keep climate change to survivable levels and to restore nature to the equilibrium we need for our survival. Unfortunately, all of the metrics continue to go in completely the wrong direction. Human consumption is on the rise and emissions are too. And many major countries like the US, Saudi Arabia and Russia are still blocking IPCC science reports from UN talks. We know that one of the most viable options for removing CO2 from the atmosphere is planting trees. And yet, over 4,000 football pitches worth of the Amazon rainforest is being torn down daily. This was three times lower only a few years ago. Forests are the most important safe havens on land for biodiversity, and we need biodiversity to prevent collapse of the food system. At the moment, 14% of all birds, 25% of all mammals, and 40% of all amphibians are on the brink of extinction. But we can turn this around. There are still more than 3 trillion trees on Earth. That's more than 10 times the number of stars in the galaxy. Which is pretty cool, right? We need to plant 1 trillion to cancel out the last 10 years of emissions and then we need to keep planting. If you want to help with planting trees directly check out Plant for the Planet and Rising Trees and if you want to help the trees indirectly then remember the biggest driver of deforestation and soil degradation worldwide is farming. Especially beef farming so join no beef and in general the less meat the better. And as ever to get involved in wider action follow Greta Thunberg and Extinction Rebellion. Thanks for watching, spread the knowledge.